Okay, good one, good mate, John Knight here. We're hunting bushbuck today with John's recurve. We in the middle of winter. It's been a harsh winter. We we haven't had much rain in the growing season. There's a very old bushbuck ram that we've been seeing. He floats around between this dry riverbed and these old lands up on the on the behind us here. I don't think he's going to make the end of winter. Um, so I've asked John Knight to come in more of a cull hunt than a than anything else. So tell us a little bit about your setup. Yeah, thanks. So, um, at least uh, nice having a chance to get out and test this bow. It's a PSC Stalker, uh, 45 pound, and I'm shooting um, these Acmos arrows at 460 grains, and I'm sure they've been pretty effective on war dogs. So they'll do the job well. Nice, and then see if we can find it. Yeah. <laughs> Um, there's a st nice steady breeze coming in from the east and uh, he likes lying in the whole mealy bed, uh, dry mealies, so we're going to scan these lands through until we get a sight. Sorry about that, but I'm uh, having a severe heart problem. The pains come up very quickly. Um, I've had two, a double, triple, and a double long pass, ten stents. Just came out of ICU a week ago, and uh, I'm going back for another procedure in two weeks. Don't know how much longer I can keep it up, but as long as I can, and we keep going as long as we can keep walking, we keep going. I really don't know what happened. <laughs> I um, somehow dropped the shot completely on him, which is really not the normal. I don't have any put a potato shot in like that for some time. I think it's maybe a little bit of bock horse. <laughs> and uh, we put him up again, but we decided to leave him. And we'll try again maybe later or tomorrow. Yeah. 
arrow skipped quite a bit and travelled about at least 20 yards past. But at least we found it. Clean. Okay, I'm just going to give it a break and then try later. later. made a second attempt at getting this bush but we came through the bottom end of the land over there we sweep the top section now and we're going to make a sweep of the bottom hopefully he is hiding in the shrubs and stuff yeah, I mean, <laughs> shrubs <laughs> yeah He'll we'll come back. Oh, I'm sure he lives in these lands often. See, yeah, often, often. Okay, we'll take a walk back up. Uh, day three. We didn't come right the first couple of days. Uh, they led us a bit of a chase, and uh, the wind in our direction is chase. Uh, uh, moved, uh, what's it, westly. So we're going to circle down. We did see him at the bottom end of the land, so we're going to circle and come in from against the wind. Let's go for it. Getting too old for this. Never. Well, I think this is day four, so we're going to have another go at him. Hopefully, we can uh, get him where he's not in that thick stuff. Uh, I must shoot better than I have been shooting. <laughs>
difficult to lie down. Still hot for four days. <laughs> oh, John. Yes, look. This stuff is thick to shoot in. We took a little hole. Uh, all you had? That's all I had. Nothing, nothing, nothing. He's so old, he is yeah. absolutely ancient. Well, we finally got up to this ram. It's been, we've been watching it over probably a month period. It's pure skin and bone. Um, we picked up on a video yesterday. It looks like he's been poked by another ram and he's developed the infection. Um, they do fight aggressively. They scary things to watch when they get into each other. We found him in the land in this stuff. I don't know what they call it, but we circled downwind. He was lying down and sleeping in this stuff. From close, we actually saw that his eyes were closed and we managed to get in and I managed just to find a hole big enough uh, to put an arrow through and uh, that put him down. So, very pleased. Um, we've actually put an animal out of a, a miserable state of there. He's so, th he's absolutely skin and bone. Um, it's really been a mercy killing. Um, as bad a condition he was, he led us quite a chase, chase around. And, uh, yeah, pleased to have finished it off properly. <laughs> Draw what we just did thing. Yeah, let's see if we can find this ram. That's what's that? Let's see if we can find the ram. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just made a sweep at the top of the land, we saw him and you think he's playing a games with us, cat and mouse. And um, he's on the lower part of the land is a drop off of the valley. That's just fine. Okay, let's do it again. I think. Oh, damn, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>